Southwest Florida school districts are dropping AP psychology and using courses that are in compliance with Florida law. This after the college board announced Florida will not allow teaching of AP psychology because lessons on sexual orientation and gender identity are forbidden in the state. Wait News reporter Claire Galt joins us now in the studio and Claire, what districts have made that change? Lois Collier County Schools told me this afternoon the district is keeping the AP Psychology class, but Lee County is not, and no word from Charlotte County. But school districts across the state face the same question. If they teach the course, do they risk breaking Florida law? Tonight, the state's Department of Education won't answer that question. One week before school starts, Lee County Schools is throwing out AP Psychology altogether. Why? School board member Debbie Jordan told me the district fears teaching the class could be breaking the law. There's that fine line is, is that violating the law because you might speak about a certain subject in a certain chapter. State law makes it a crime to teach students about gender identity and sexual orientation. That's why last Thursday the college board said in a statement Florida quote effectively banned their AP psychology course which features discussions on those topics. Friday the DOE sent a letter to all superintendents saying AP psychology quote can be taught in its entirety in a manner that is age and developmentally appropriate. Jordan told me the district isn't willing to risk legal trouble but at what cost? Even speaking to students who have had that class and what they believe that they um, learned from that uh, and what they gained from it for them not to be able to, re you know, to receive that. It, I think that's, you know, it's kind of sad. I'm very concerned for the students who won't get the opportunity to take a course that's, you know, stood the course of time. The Lee County School District will instead offer site classes provided by International Baccalaureate and Cambridge Advanced International Certificate of Education. Catherine Gruss, Chief Education Officer for the American Psychological Association, told me those classes don't compare to AP Psych. The major difference with the AP Psychology course is it's, it has very clear learning outcomes for the learner, um, much more detailed than the, the other two courses with, and with respect to specifying specific content that students must master as part of the course. And while he did not say it's because of the confusion, a Collier County spokesperson did tell me the district will review syllabi from each AP psychology teacher and assist in creating lessons that will be in compliance with Florida law. Now, if Collier Schools removes the gender identity and sexual orientation lessons, the college board may not allow those students to qualify for AP credit. I pressed Florida's Department of Education for clarification several times, but no one got back to me. Well, All right, thank you.